Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Rogue Tech Cold Forged. So today we're going to jump straight into a couple of missions. We're going to do a Light Lance mission first, and then we're going to move on and we're going to do a mission with the Heavy Lance. So the first thing we're going to do is jump in with Cease and Desist, and it's a Destroy Base mission. Hopefully the Light Lance can pull this off, one and a half skulls. And we're going to go full salvage, or should we just go full sea bills? I think probably full sea bills. Well, you never know. We might find something good. Let's go half and half. All right, so we're going to take out our main lance. And we're going to put in our light lance. This should be fun, I think. So let's bring in our spider, our cattle master, and our two, two herbies. We're going to go with Havoc in the spider. And we've got um, quarterback, I think, will go in the, the uh, cattle master. And then our orchid and poison into the urban max. And let's deploy and get this done. Command interface initiated. All right, here we go. So this is a familiar base map. Um, let's just reserve. See what the enemy does. Reserving action. Yeah, they're going to reserve right back too, probably. But at least we can get past the turrets. Okay, so let's move up. See if we can find out who we're up against here. Consider me there. Yeah, I don't know yet. We don't have tactics high enough to figure out what these guys are. But we know this base mission, so we know what we're up against here. Don't really care how heavy these guys are. Can I just commando? Okay, let's get into here. It's nice having good speed on these guys. Gonna dump everything into him. Uh, lots of ammo, so why not? What's gonna be tricky is when we get down to the turrets. We're gonna have to move right in and shoot on them to, to shoot on those turrets. Um, it's going to put us in sight of the turrets, I think, there. But here I think we're okay. So let's get into here. Double time. Let's go. And we're just going to pot shot with um, the medium laser and the light rifle on this guy. No point in wasting machine gun ammo yet. Oh, nice. So that's probably an Irby. I don't know. Medium lasers? Commander. Okay, poison. Let's get into here. And we'll do the same thing. Just running. Leave the machine guns off. Our light rifle in the machine gun. Or the medium laser. Okay. That's probably an enforcer. Uh, and they got missiles. That figures. It's going to make things problematic, I think. Not very many missiles, though. Oh, I take it back. Okay, now we have to identify the main threat here. So let's bring in... They got two lights and two mediums. Ready for orders. Um, let's get into... Here, I think. On it. See what we're up against here. Hunchback 4G with an AC-20, eh? So that guy's got to go down. 
large AC-10. Eesh. Chances to hit are really bad here. But then again, I mean, we have brand new pilots, so that's the thing. Alright, let's just shoot up this, uh, this guy here. And we'll fire everything. Yeah, we got really low damage weapons here, so it's going to be really difficult. Reporting minimal damage. Okay, the hunchback's got to go down, so let's get a start on him, Havoc. Um, probably not the best place to attack from, but we're going to go... I mean, the other way is to... No, we got to go after this guy. Well, hang on a minute. How's it going? Hmm. How do we want to run this now? Forty percent on this guy. It's gonna open us up to turret fire here though. Gotta to get to a position where we can cross without an issue. Unless we come down to the valley here. Let's do that. Roger that. No shooting, just running. Okay, so we're gonna target this guy. Giving them everything I've got. Okay, head hit, nice. Okay, another commando. Not a big deal. I think what we want to do is probably try to eliminate these guys down here fast. So let's do that first, then we'll be in a better position to attack the Hunchback. Okay. Now Orchid... Can we get you in the valley? We can, kind of. So let's do that. Roger. Hoping that the evasion is going to really help us out here. Leave the light rifle off because the bad chance to hit. Fire everything else. And he's going to be unconscious now. Okay, so one down. He's coming into melee, basically going to end up dying here, probably. 42 is a lot of damage, though. Okay, that's interesting. Light damage, Commander. They've got a lock on me. Yeah, here comes the missiles. Okay, we walked out of that one without too much problems. Light damage. Holding firm. Okay, so um, the big threat right now is for order. this guy. And the thing about Hunchbacks is they have notoriously bad back armor. Going to take full advantage of that. Let's get right around behind him. Everything straight into his back. All weapons are go. You know, it's you know when it's bad when our f the flamers are some of our biggest damage weapons. Oh my God. That guy's got to die too. 
reporting major armor loss. Waiting for orders. Location confirmed. Okay, light rifle will leave off. We don't need it right now. And fire the rest. Blast off for your armor. Excellent. Now, we're going to see if we can get poison in on this fun. Uh, not quite. But let's run Havoc then. Uh, or do we want to attack from... No, we got to move. So we're going to attack from over there. Hopefully we don't knock him down. Ah, crap. Okay, gonna go for a head hit here. Receiving you. Just like this. I copy. And we'll leave the light rifle. We might as well leave it on. Gonna go for the head hit. Fire everything. Ugh, not quite. That's bad. Lost a lot of weapons. I was really hoping to kill a hunchback this turn. Oh, you better miss. Oh my god. Kent. Hey. Upright. Okay, that's some punishment. He's got 78 as an internal so far. Still. So Havoc. Um, God, what do we got left here? Medium and a heavy machine gun. bad. Okay, let's get into here. Dump everything on this guy's back. And we'll just fire. Just hoping for crits there. Damn it. Okay, let's hope this one's better. Everything into this guy's back. Okay, there goes the AC-20 and the mech. Guess we got a headshot there. Okay, Havoc, let's start on this guy. Maybe we can take that AC. Yeah. They've got a lock on me. <sighs> Come on, man, you gotta get up. Commander. Okay. Ready for action. How are you? You think so, do you?
Ah, what do we do here? I think we got to push this guy more than anything. Let's get some evasion chevrons going here. Heading reduced mobility. My mech is limping. That's okay. Okay, there's a knockdown. Oh, okay, good. So only got one point left in his head. They're getting the angle on me. Still good shooting, even though he got knocked down. What do we do, guys? Inflict as much damage on this guy as we can. Hopefully we can knock him down. We're almost out of ammo. We lost ammo because of the leg. Um... Yep, we go this route, I guess. Putting one in the back. This guy's got to die, too. He's becoming a nightmare. Maybe we take him this turn. Let's let's move these guys first, though. Um, if I move back, though, way less chance to hit. Let's get in close. It's not the best move in the world, but we're going to have to take it. Got the angle. Take it. Yeah, and firing everything. everything I've got. <sighs> a critical hit. Commander? Well, this guy's a possible kill. So let's take it if we can. Can't get right behind him though. So let's hit him on this side again. Confirm. Maybe we can get a knockdown. Okay, that should do it. Okay, he's out. They've got a lock on me. Yeah, I know. Weather this storm and we can take care of this uh commando. Then we gotta worry about turrets. Where's that long time artillery when you need it? Hey there. Okay. Straight on this guy. Uh, actually, how much has he got in his back? It is a possibility to kill him if we attack him from behind. But if we don't kill him... Large lasers here, right? Maybe we do a side attack and try and take the arm? No, let's go for the kill. We do need the, we need the kill more than we needed the arm, I think. Let's do this. Come on. Okay, we did get the right arm anyway, so that's good. Yes, Commander. Uh, we're almost out of ammo. Can we bullet? Yeah, I was hoping we could just run into this guy, but we can't. Uh, orchid. Sprint up here. And we can use everything on this guy. Okay, there we go. Now we gotta figure out how we're gonna approach these turrets. I think we gotta use the forest as cover here. So let's get up here. On my way. They're gonna be sensor locking too, so waiting for orders. Let's move.
So that was a tough opening. Ugh. I think if we had, um... If our mechs had, um... How's it going? Let's give them something to shoot for. If we had, uh... I don't know if I can hit them with the Wrecking Ball from here. I think the Wrecking Ball will hit from here. Um, if we had longer range weapons on these guys and more energy efficient weapons, I think it would be better. But we want the machine gun route, so... Okay, let's see if we can kill this turret. Okay, you're not doing anything. Commander. You, on the other hand... Maybe finish this turret up? It looks like we can. Uh, let's multi-target then. Get the best of use of our time here. And B, I'll get the medium laser. Everything else to A. On it. Okay. Receiving you. That's actually pretty good. Affirmative. We gotta hit these guys hard and fast, so... Less chance to hit there. But this thing's almost dead. So let's take a chance and try and kill this guy. Roger. Okay, good hit. Nope, not quite enough. Receiving you. Yeah, we can't sprint, so we're just gonna move over here and brace. Way. I think this guy's effectively done now until we can get this the uh, turrets gone. I've been sent to luck. Yeah, you've also got the least amount of damage on you, so... Okay, we need to see. Waiting for orders. This other turret. Let's get over here and hopefully kill this guy. Engage. Okay. Turret eliminated. Now we can use havoc up, to hammer this turret. On the move. Um, let's leave the medium pulse off, I guess. Well, 16 times 3 will do more than the medium laser will, but we're still overheated, so I'm going to go this route. Excellent. Can just brace. Commander. Can we get to a position where he can't hit us? I think so. It's an LRM turret though. Oh, well, that's fine. I think we'll be okay here. Full speed. No yeah, we're just going to target this building and fire everything. Alright guys, we're almost done this one. Good to go. Yep, so note to self. Um, definitely do not want to be uh, running a light lance without any kind of ranged weapons. Yes, Commander. Yeah, fire. Although the speed really helps us out. Okay, let's shoot this building. Alright, let's see if quarterback can finish us up. I doubt it, but we'll see. Fire everything. There we go. Nicely done. Alright, Inc contract increased by 35%. 636,000. Nicely done. 
Okay, we got a lot of stuff we gotta fix, but that's okay. Light rifles and some machine guns we lost. I'll rejiggy this guy a bit, I think, to maybe, I don't know. Ah, I don't know, we'll figure out what we're gonna do with that guy. Um, yeah, so there we go. And salvage. We can choose one part. Um, back to enforcers, engines. I don't know, man. Lower arm. Let's just take... Don't really need fusion cores. <laughs> Wait a minute, how many lower arms do we have? Nine. Okay, we don't need that. Uh, I don't know, let's take an enforcer piece. What the heck? Okay, one, two commander pieces. One, two, three. Oh, two enforcer pieces, two hunchback pieces. And AC-20 ammo. Nice. Yeah, we're going to decline the invitation. Never put yourself in a position where you can take from your uh, your crew. All right, 57,000 repairs. That's not too bad. So we made some good C-bills on that. All right, now let's jump into a second mission. It's a great thing about having multiple lenses. You don't have to wait here. So let's go right into contracts. And we're going to go down here. We're going to take uh, Burden and Proof, I think. Ambush Convoy at four and a half skulls? Why not? Um, they've got illegal activities. Intercept the convoy and destroy it. No problem. And since they, it is four and a half skull, let's just go all out here for our salvage. So we'll flush these guys out. Let's bring our main lance in. And we're bringing in the Zeus, the Catapult 1R. Warhammer, and where are you here? Oh, do we not repair the Wolverine? Spiked Fist, Patchwork Materials. We didn't repair the Wolverine? Okay, we gotta see what we can do about that first. Thought I repaired that. Let's have a quick look. Should have been more mindful. Come on. I think we picked up a spike fist though. Picked up something. Um, we needed to patchwork materials tier 2, which we don't have. Engine lamb. Oh, right. I remember about these. Jump distance. Double heatsink kit. Lower arm melee. Retractable blade. Talons. Right, we wanted to add talents, didn't we? Defensive gyro, what else do we have? Combat shield, which we have. Is that it? That's it. So, and just stealth armor, we don't have. Okay. Let's take, um, so the spike fist we lost did extra melee damage. Patchwork materials has to come out. So let's put in the retractable blade, which is here. Right? Yeah, it's pretty close to what that, that spike fist was. More melee damage. Okay, that's actually better. But it's probably weightier too, right? Yeah. Um... And what else do we have here? I mean, we could pull the, the defensive gyro. I don't know though. Losing one evasion for extra weight. This talons would be nice. Spiked leg boots give us what? Plus five base melee damage. Just one ton. Talons are one and a half tons. Um. Boomstick's nice, but we've got to use weapon. you got to use ammo with it. What if we change? Do we have anything else here that we could use? Fire fists. Um, I don't think that's quite as good, though. The plasma lance is pretty good. It's only three tons, too, right? 50 damage, but it's pinpoint. Stability, 15. This has got range, though. Stability, 3 times... 10, so 30 possibly if everything hits. 
plus 20% melee damage. Ah, I don't know, it's a tough choice. This adds heat. Double chance to do a critical hit with the weapon. 10 additional base melee damage. Let's try using... Let's take, put in the Plasma Lance. We're looking for damage really, right? So Plasma Lance, and then let's put in... Um, we don't have any more support points, but that's fine. So we're going to go to here and put in... Um, where are you here? We want the Talons. What's our melee damage doing here? I don't think that's even accurate. Um, spike Fist is plus 5, plus 10, plus 20. Plus 30. And then 25, 70, 80% more. Does this thing add any extra damage, base damage? No, it doesn't. Um, defensive gyro, do we have? We got laser AMS. Actually, fusion cores are 300. Do we have anything bigger? We can make it faster. 325. 16 tons, this is 12 and a half. It could go that route. Single heat sink. Right? Now we're going 270 kilometers an hour, which is pretty good. This is how much? Mm, another ton and a half. I think I want to save that. Do we have any ECMs? We have to have, oh, we got the angel in us already. Right. Um, command console will be kind of cool though. Injury resist. It's six tons though. Base slight distance. Initiative phase bonus. Uh, that's kind of cool too. So we've got. What's our heat efficiency here? 25 with an alpha strike. Hmm. Can't put anything else in the arms, unfortunately. So it would be a missile system if we put anything in. Do we have that tag LRM5 NARC? That's an option too, right? Throw that in. And do we have half tons of LRM ammo? This is plus one accuracy though. Can we lose a half a ton anywhere? It's the well, actually, you know what? If we do this, put our case back in, right? And then put our patchwork materials in. Let's just put it in the head. And we only have to take off 0.25. So if we just go like 1, 2, 3, 4. There we go. Let's do that. Five days. Let's confirm this. See how this works out. So we're going to wait the five days. Oop. Six days. Sorry, I forgot I had other things in line there. Okay, so let's go to the command center. Let's take this contract now. And we're doing... Where are you here? Burden of proof. Full out. Let's do this. Okay. There should be a way to prep your lances in advance. You need more, more slots in this. Like, the lance should already be set up and ready to go. Um... Warhammer and Wolverine 1R. There we go. And then Cold Metal, uh, Hickory, and Raider, and Pylon. Let's do this, guys. Okay, here we go. 
So I think because this is four and a half skulls, we've got enough speed to be able to get up there before uh, they slip past us. So green. All right. So I'm really hoping for like some hunter tunners here. We've got uh, a bunch of parts we can start putting together a hunter ton mech with. We get to choose three salvage, so maybe we yeah. can get some good hunter ton pieces. Also, I think this arrow is going to come in really handy in this mission. Take on vehicles. So there's a couple ways you can play this mission if you're fast enough. Um, you obviously go straight up here. You can kind of move in front of the vehicles here or go up on the hill and attack. Um, either one is fine. You just have to keep in mind at lower levels that they've got like fast hover vehicles that can get right past you. If you're really slow, the other way to do it is to come up around this way and cut them off in here because they have to come down and around and then in, into their final uh, extraction point. So we're not going to go very fast here. So they do have a lot of heavy vehicles because they're not showing up on my uh, sensors yet. Roger. I don't want to initiate combat combat just yet. What do you need? All right, full Man, this speed. catapult is fast. If we can get another arrow system. I'll lower the engine and then just, just make out a long range devastating mech. Don't think that's going to happen before episode 100 though, so... But we never know. Okay, Pylon, let's see if we can get some eyes on now. What's up, boss? Well, at least sensors on. Got it. Nope. Bandit. Oh, yep, finally. Okay, these guys are really slow. Um, I think we want the hill. Time. Let's, go. Let's try and get the height advantage on these guys. Yep. So they got a lot of heavies and assaults. 95 ton vehicle. Let's hope the guards aren't vehicles. Okay. Crap. I opened my mouth too soon. There should be one more guy there somewhere. They got a lock on me. Of course they do. So we gotta start seeing these guys sooner rather than later. Come on. Send me a real mech warrior. You know, Hickory, if you say things like that, someone's gonna hit you right in the head. Do they think they can hurt me? Yeah, just stop talking, please. Orders? Okay, let's get some eyes on. No shooting, just running. Okay, Demolisher, let's see if we can land an arc on this guy. Okay, they got weakened armor too, which is good. Firing. Got it. Okay, ping. Nice. Seventy-five tonner, Marauder. Okay. It's not the Marauder too, but we'll take it. Yeah. Our target is within sensor range. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Might as well just ATM them. Let them know we're coming. Yeah. Understood. Um Yeah, one of each.
I missed with them both. Negative damage. Wow. Antos, Mark Six. Two like gosses, two okay, he's not too bad. That's an eighty ton vehicle. Let's get in here, see if we can nab a quick kill on this guy. Shrek. Okay, not too bad. Um, let's do it. Ah, crap. Missed the large laser. We needed that to kill him. Oh, well. That was worth it, though. Jesus. That's all you got? Oh, stop it. So, what are we missing here? Isn't there supposed to be another vehicle or something? That's the Antos, right? Warning. Enemy sensor lock detected. Another Shrek. Okay, they got another vehicle back here. That's what it was we were missing here. It's mostly vehicles. That sucks. Really? So I guess we have to max out the um, salvage from this Marauder. Okay, so he's the, used up all his rocket launchers. What's this guy? Thunderbolt launcher? <sighs> Thunderbolt 15s, man. He's got to go. All right, pylon. Standing by. Pylon leading the charge. Um, we're gonna use Phantom Mech, and we're gonna get right in here on this guy and attack him. On the move. Targeting for physical attack. Look at those chevrons, man. Ten chevrons of evasion. Ah, uh, that distracted me from how much damage he was doing, too. I wanted to see how much it was. They've got a lock on me. Gonna need more than one. Yep. Um. Heading out. We want this guy. Uh, we're gonna Warlord it, because I think we want a better chance to hit. Just gonna fire on him. Roger. Come on. Yes. Nice. Vehicle trash. So he was one of the guards. Raider. Yes, Commander. Um, have we targeted any? We haven't targeted these guys yet, have we? Rhino? No. Antos. The Shrek we have, though. Um, can we see the Shrek? Cannot. So then there's no point in sprinting. Let's just get into oops, into here. Aye. Stay in the woods, and we'll target this guy. Rhino, two LRM20s, lots of armor. We're gonna uh, what's the chance to hit here? Really good. We're gonna roll it up, get some max damage on this guy because he's we gotta soften this guy up. Take this. Okay, we hit with everything. That was awesome. He's going to be taking the uh, the arrow next. He can't do a lot of damage, but because he's got lots of armor, we want to kill him as fast as we can. Oh, we did really well in the front. Excellent. Okay, Mr. Metal. Show us your metal. Going to come down here. Get my stability back. Where's that Shrek? There he is. Going to dump everything straight into this guy. Ugh, oh, we missed with it. Ugh, just not enough. We missed with the AC though, that's why. 32 left.
Gotta move more than that guy. What did this guy have? I know I was just looking at him, but two LRM 10s and a bunch of rocket launchers. Okay. Demolisher. Eesh. We gotta kill that guy. That's Pylon's job. Oh, this is the other Shrek here. Right. Ooh. Ow. Yes, Commander. Demolisher, please. Uh, from behind. Coordinates received. Oh, not quite enough, eh? How do we do, though? This guy's gonna knock me down. I've been sensor locked. Oh, one point left in the turret. Uh, doesn't that figure? What do you need? Can we get a direct... Uh, if you move out here though, they're gonna all see us. So let's just move back here a bit. I'll do what I can. And then we're gonna launch it into the rhino here. Let's not let him get too far ahead. Nice. Enemy vehicle destroyed. Okay, Raider. Um... I'm gonna handle two targets here, I think. I'm gonna pull off a multi. Uh, the damage Shrek is this one, so we're gonna attack him and the Demolisher. And... We'll put... I'm gonna go this way. I wanna make sure we kill the Shrek in case we don't hit the front or the top or whatever. Split fire. Confirm. Like that. Really? Come on, hit it. There we go. One more for the rubbish bin. Took all those all those shots to take the turret though. This guy's gonna try and knock me down now. Nope. Sensor locking, eh? Okay, let's get our vigilance going. Um Not really concerned about the Marauder for right now. It's not that big of a threat. I mean, two ERPPCs and AC5, but we're inside is big kind of minimum range. There's no point worrying about that. 32 left on the side, so we're going to multi-target this out. I'm going to hit this guy and this guy, and we'll put the missiles on B. Engaging. Oh, nice! <sighs> Those lasers, man. They do good damage, but they have a harder chance hitting. I should do it. I'm picking up a new sensor trace. Oh, of course. Looks like enemy reinforcements. Maybe we get some mechs this time. Although, I don't, I don't think I've ever had reinforcements on this map, so I don't know where they're coming from. I guess I should really watch out for uh, Hickory over here by yourself. Systems holding. Yep, from back over there. an ATM-3. Oh, they're over here. 80 ton? 100 ton. Okay, we finally got some stuff that we can uh, get some stuff from. Oh my god. I call bullshit. I hate it how they just spawn behind you. I'm getting my ass kicked. That's just bullshit. Try and kill this Shrek. Just putting my weight into it. Vehicle down. Okay. Standing by.
11 on that one torso. That's where the arrow is on this side. Shoot this guy. That pisses me off that they can spawn like that. Scored a critical hit. Ooh, you hit. Oh, we only got six chevrons of evasion though. Okay, so I don't really care about Marauder so much anymore. Because we got a hundred tonner coming in that we can grab some salvage off of. So let's uh, drop this guy. Let's drop him like he's hot. Yeah, I'll fire everything into his backside. If we can get Raider into a position, we can shoot both the vehicle and uh, that mech. Oh, fuck's sakes. <sighs> Stand and buy. Forty-five left on the side. Vehicle hasn't gone yet, so let's take care of the vehicle first. Roger. Just gonna put those on B. Might never know, we might get lucky. There we go, that should do it. Get your lance to the LZ commander. I'm coming in hot. Okay, knockdown, nice. So he's down to two. Bullshit. Those heat levels. I'm here. All right, full speed. Okay, turning our sides now. I'm generating a lot of heat. Yeah, I know you are. 55 tonner. Um, gonna reserve pylon. 45. All right, so they got a hundred tonner. I'm here. Why? Do, I got a feeling it's like an, an atlas or something. I'm there. You're here. You're there. You're everywhere. Let's just kill this guy. Actually, let's aim for his head. Yeah, he's done. And yeah, we did hit him in the head too. Nice. I'm gonna get pilot into a murdering position. I'm gonna attack that 80 tonner. Because I'm pissed. It's an awesome, it looks like. Sure is. Awesome APQ. <laughs> awesome BBQ, man. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> That's what it's supposed to be. <laughs> it's the barbecue. Awesome. Okay, cool. Um, can't get close to that guy. I'm going to take a turn and cool off here, though. Actually, can we get a good shot on this guy? ER large. Might as well move around and take a pot shot at him. You never know, we might get lucky. Eh. Yeah. Can't have everything. No so Pylon's got 10 chevrons. Just gonna reserve. Let's see what they do here. Phoenix Hawk, not too worried. Wow. 
he's got such a good chance to hit. That was uh, really well done, buddy. Um, let's make it so that they can't um, shoot us. We're not going to fire. On my way. Just going to walk and brace. My heat sinks can't take much more of this. Yeah, I know. We're trying to cool off. Receiving you. Understood. Moving fast. You'll understand what I'm doing here in a second. Can't afford engaging unwisely. Target the awesome now. Nice. I know he's got damage re reduction. Bear with me here for a second. Good to go. And here it comes. Here we go. Got past the armor. I'm receiving you. Ten four. And the next one. Should be able to just plaster this guy here. Copy that, Commander. Make him unstable. Ah, oh, not quite enough, damn it. That's alright. Let me get back here though. Um Want to get too close to this guy now? Just gonna fire on him. Oh, we messed with both. Really? Ugh. If he was unstable, I would have pushed him, but he wasn't, so there's no point in moving in. Okay, pylon. I'm gonna reserve you. That's a Wolverine 2. Damage minimal. So we're gonna rotate our attack to that guy. Unless this Phoenix Hawk gives us a reason to kill him right away. So how did that guy see us? Oh, 
Awesome still is yet to go. Um, I'm here. Still gotta cool down. So let's just get over here. Roger. Let's see what they do here. For tactical advantage. Oh. That's interesting. Let's see who we want here between these two guys. 44. It's the same, pretty much. So we're going to target this guy. Let him know how unappreciated he is right now. I don't want to push that 100 tonner. Yes, Commander. Not yet, anyway. Not to be of a better command of this situation first. Yeah, fire on this guy. By the time we hit that 100 ton mech, we're going to have our uh, our warlord back again. Commander. Ooh, we can't quite get this guy, eh? Um. Can do this though. Roger. Oh yeah, ninety nine damage now. Okay, nice. Ugh. Damn it. He's back up to almost where he was before. He had one hundred and three damage before. That guy was braced too. No, he wasn't braced. Now it's your turn, Amelia. Is it? He wants to play the melee game. Could go for a back shot, but then that awesome's gonna get a back shot on me. So let's do this. On it. Engaging. See, that's how you do it, buddy. Yeah, man. Solid connection on that Your one. instability is my advantage. That Phoenix Hawk doing? A whole lot of nothing. Standing by. Okay, let's get into here. And everything into the side of this guy. All weapons are moved. That might be it. Critical hit, Commander. Nope. Pretty damn close though, I think. Left leg gone. Yeah, he just needs one good hit to the CT. So how many missiles we got left, Hickory? We got five arrows. Acknowledge. Um. Let's just use a thunderbolt on this guy. Let's see if we can take his head off. Yeah. I want to save the arrows for that hunter tonner just in case. Ooh, nice shot, buddy. Okay, it's got stable, and we're gonna multi-target this out. This guy and this guy. B will take the LRMs. And I guess we're overheating here. Let's turn those off for now. Yeah, I'll fire everything. We'll, we'll get our warlord back next turn. So actually, let's do... Um, um, this. Oh yeah, EC20 hit, nice. Not quite enough to make him unstable. 
And not enough to kill that guy. Oh well. That's alright. King Crab, okay. We got crab parts. If I was unstable, man, that would be scary as shit. Two Ultra 10s, two MRM 20s, two ER mediums. Not too bad. Um, Good to go. Heading out. Okay. Doing this. I want to pull that awesome in a little closer. I'm here. You don't even need to move, girl. Oh yeah, you do. Um, interesting. We can't hit the uh, king crab. I guess that hill is completely blocking him. Oh, we can't see him. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, yeah, that's right, because the Wolverine moved. Um, seventy-two on this guy, eighty-seven on this guy. I know we're using a lot of heat here, but we're gonna do this. Engaging. I want that awesome to be unstable. Oh, really? Come on, kill this guy. Nice. Okay, we have the advantage now. I'm receiving you. Got to come out in the open for this guy, do we? Okay. Quick step in it. We'll do it. We have to. Um, ATM six is almost empty. Fire everything. Oh, that looks like it might have been a head hit. Oh yeah, man. Goodbye, buddy. Enemy eliminated. I don't know how many awesome parts we have too. We got a few of those, I think. Kicking around somewhere. Um not gonna engage the crab just yet. We are gonna engage this guy with wrath. Maybe not. Wow. Bad chances to hit, eh? Just drop some LRM 15s on this guy. We still got lots. Okay, so I think I want this Phoenix Hawk gone before we engage the crab. Receiving you. Before we get crabs. So let's, where can we maximize our damage here? Side? The side or the front maybe? Oh, he's got no back armor. We're going to attack him from behind. Maybe we get lucky and kill him. We can do 100 damage from behind. 99 anyway. There goes the right torso. Hmm, not quite enough. Solid connection on that one. Aye, aye. Um, you're just gonna vent heat. Let's just sit here. Got it. Venting heat. Where was that? There it is. Confirm. Yeah, we're gonna fire everything on this guy. He should go down this turn. Um, do I want Warlord in this? Leave the ATMs and the LBXs off. We don't need them. Uh, we're gonna use Warlord in the uh, King Crab, so we're gonna, just gonna do this. Okay, so he's gone. Mech destroyed. So we're going to reserve cold metal. Oh, we don't need to. Okay, people. Let's get real. Let's get him in that arc. There we go. Okay. First of all, we're going to Vigilance, Warlord, and 105 in the legs, eh? 
I'm feeling really good about this today. We're gonna try for a headshot. Okay, we got a head hit. How much damage did we do though? It <laughs> was got one left. Uh I'm really taking a gamble doing this, but uh, we're going to do um, Warlord. Going to turn the ER large. Well, we might as well leave him on. And we're going to do an offensive push on this guy's head. See if we get lucky. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, I saw 20. There we go. <laughs> okay, that couldn't have been any better. Mission successful. Okay, people. 35% extra. We're going to need this for, for repairs. Uh, we took some damage on the catapult. Double heat sink lost. I think we got a couple extras, so we should be okay. Didn't lose anything on anybody else. The only reason we got this is because they spawned right behind us again. So, just have to make sure on that map I reposition myself differently. Come on. Okay, awesome parts. King crab parts. Um, we want a hundred tonner before this series is done, so we're gonna take three of those, I think. Fire fist, we've already got. Like Goss, LRM twenties. Don't think there's anything in here we really want. MMLs are nice, but we don't necessarily need them. Look at the junk on this table, my God. Um. Yeah, nothing that's really amazingly valuable here. Even the targeting computer and inter TTS energy aren't really that great. So we'll take the three king crab parts. All right, we got four of them. Nice. Got an MML heat bank. Okay, so we made out pretty well on this. Four, four king crab parts. We might have enough to make a king crab. I think we have a couple of a different version of a king crab, but we'll see. There it is, folks. King Crab double triple O two with oh, twin ultra AC tens. Okay, so let's see what we can get out of this guy. Two hundred thirty six thousand. Not bad. A little less than I thought it was going to be. All right, let's have a look at the mech bay here. Okay, we're starting to fill up here. I'm going to take uh, the blackjack out of circulation right now because we're not really using it. So let's drop that out. Um, it's got a lot of stuff in here we can actually use for other stuff like the watchdog suite and things like that. So we're going to drop this guy out for now. Alright, and the bushwhacker. I don't think with the time that we have left in this series, I don't think we're really going to use this extra bushwhacker. We do have one, the X2, so we're just going to actually just going to uh, trash this guy for now. Scrap it for 930,000. And let's focus on getting this king crab and this catapult up and running. So maybe next episode what we do is we do half the episode of getting these guys up and then the other half the episode of uh, running with the king crab and see how it works. So let's refit this guy real quick. Yeah, we didn't get anything out of this really. Let's do a repair on it. So that's fine. We're just going to strip everything off of here. But we got tons of hard points on this guy. Missiles, uh, lasers, ballistic, all kinds of crazy shit from this guy. So we're going to really load him out. Um, and definitely going to be using this guy in some five skull missions coming up. So let's confirm this. Good thing we sold the bushwhackers because it's going to cost the bushwhackers value pretty much to get this guy up and running. Right. Okay, so between episodes, what I'm going to do, I'm going to fix the light lance. Um, I'm going to figure out a loadout for the catapult, this catapult, and we're going to figure out a loadout for the uh, king crab. So when we come back next time, we'll be able to fit those guys out. Uh, I'll fix the, uh, the light lance up, have them ready to go again. 
we'll probably end up doing maybe one, maybe two more missions with these guys. Uh, I'm not sure. Now that we've got more heavy mechs and stuff, uh, we can run two heavier lances, I think, um, and get into some more, um, uh, some tougher battles. So we're going to attempt to do that. Um, yeah, so if you have any ideas for King Crab loadouts, just drop them in the comments down below. Uh, as well as the catapults, you, you know, if there's anything you guys want to see, just let me know. We'll try and load these guys out. Um, yeah, so we're going to leave it there. If you like the episode, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please, please feel free to subscribe and mention, put some comments in the comment section down below. And until next time, we'll see you all later.